Hello, I'm uh, Chang Gi Jung. I'm a professor at Kavli IPMU and also State University of New York at Stony Brook. Today, I would like to introduce T2K experiment to you. In 1998, the Super Kamikande experiment in Japan started a new era of neutrino physics when it found unambiguous evidence that neutrino produced in the atmosphere transform from one type to another spontaneously when they travel long distances. This is known as neutrino oscillation. Neutrino oscillation is an astonishing manifestation of a quantum mechanical phenomenon at a large scale. I call this discovery the neutrino revolution. T2K is an experiment designed to discover one of the rarest forms of neutrino oscillation, namely transformation of muon neutrinos to electron neutrinos. T2K also aims to discover charge parity symmetry violation in neutrinos, which may hold a critical key to our understanding of the matter-antimatter asymmetry in the universe, one of the most profound mysteries in science. The T2K experiment that utilizes the JPEG accelerator in Tokai Ibaraki Ken that accelerates protons onto a target to produce an intense secondary particle beam that is focused by special magnets called the neutrino horns, which is shown right here. The focused particle beam decays into a beam of neutrinos, which is monitored by a neutrino detector 280 meters from the target. This beam of neutrinos then travels 295 kilometers underground to be detected in the Super Kamikande detector. After about three years of data taking, T2K now has established an observation of electron neutrino appearance from muon neutrinos. This opens a clear path towards measuring the charge parity violation, and I, as well as many of my colleagues, am very excited about the future of our research. The T2K collaboration consists of about 500 physicists from 11 countries, Japan, US, UK, Italy, Canada, S Switzerland, Spain, Germany, France, Poland, and Russia. Thank you very much.